Area is defined as the amount of space inside a shape. So it's the measurement of the inside of the formula is area equals length times width. So you just plug in the number six feet and four feet. So we just plug it in length times width. So six times four, which would be 24. And then for area, you would say square feet. Okay. So what if they are giving us the area, which they will, and they only give us one side and we have to find the first right our formula down. A equals length times width. We know that this is the width. So length times, that's an L. Length times three equals, and we know the area is 21. Well, we can think in our head, hmm, what times three equals 21? Seven. Okay, or I taught my students is you just do the opposite. So you would go, what's the opposite of multiplication? Division. So 21 divided by three is what? Hmm, seven. So L would equal seven. And that makes sense, right? Seven centimeters times three centimeters. Does that equal 21? Yes, yeah, so the area is 21 um, square centimeters. So that's what you have to do when you have a missing side. Looking at it, it gives us the area. So we're finding the missing side, okay? So what are my steps that I need to do? Okay, you could write the formula down. Area equals length times width, okay? The area is 147 square inches equals, they give us the length, right? But we do not know the width, okay? So it's seven times W equals 147. So I taught my class, you do the inverse operation, the opposite um, of multiplication is division, okay? Remember we always use the biggest number first, so 147, divided by seven. Okay, now you can just use long division. Bring down, so 21 is our answer. Um, so the missing side is 21 inches.